is open. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Oh. oh, my goodness. Oh. All right. Another storage unit. Finally, my man's back. I'm back. But we do have an issue over here. What happened, man? I uh, sadly broke my hand at work. Okay. Um, I was not very smart, drilling in some concrete. Uh -huh. Drill snapped, and there goes my hand. But yeah, we're almost done. Stone, but now it's off. Yeah, well, hey. Yeah. Still, uh, oh, let's, let's, let's ask for a speedy recovery in the comments, guys. My man. All right, what do you think about this unit? Spent a thousand bucks for it. And uh, it's a huge unit, guys. 10 by 20, it goes all the way back. As you can see there, this is gonna be a massive unit. I was telling Ashley on the way here, I was like, yeah, we'll be able to get this thing in a uh, one load. No, 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 okay. no, no. no. <laughs> uh, but we're going to go through all this. I want to show you what it looks like before we got in it. Um, I do like the fact that they wrapped their mattress, which is nice. And then, and obviously they love their alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> um, there's a jewelry chest, I believe, over here as well. Look at that Singer sewing machine. This is going to be a good unit, folks. So... What we're gonna do is we're gonna pull some stuff out because it's really hard to show you how it is now. We'll get the garbage bags out, we'll pull some stuff out. I'll do most of the work this time. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, yeah, you gotta help it. Um, so I'm gonna pull some of this stuff out, guys, and then we'll start filming some of these boxes and see what's in here. So hang tight. It's good to be back. And it's good to get a unit that's not fabric, as much as the yeah. fabric is cool. Yeah. Fabric's been great. Fabric has been great, but these people want to see... A little change of pace. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so let's do it, baby. All right. So we did create a hole. Um, I've got a couple of the garbage. Don't worry, guys. It was just closed. We have not looked through anything. We just, wanted to get, we just wanted to get to the um, good stuff, so that way we can start filming here. But we're going to go through this real quick, and then we're going to start pulling out some more stuff. We have not seen anything yet. Um, we just took the big black bags over here, and then also the furniture item. So now we can get to the back. In fact, I, I can't even see what the back looks like. But that's uh, kind of what we see there. So we got a lot of boxes unpacked. But let's go through this because you yeah. never know what's in these drawers. All, All right. right. All right, my man. Starting up top. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Okay. Do they have the key keys to those? Nope. Would have been nice if they had the keys to them. I would use I them. Uh, a stud finder. Oh, a stud. A deep here, here, let, me, let me just see here. <laughs> beep, 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 Found it. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh there's a bunch of cards, cards and stuff in there. Okay. Oh, Pokemon. Okay. For all those Pokemon oh fans gosh. out there. He bought a lot of cards. Look at all those things. Those little inserts. Wow. They go to... Yeah, these come with... Oh, my goodness. He bought a lot of them. So we got an avid card collector here, maybe. A walkie-talkie or something. A bunch of cards back mm -hmm. here. Pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Well, SD cards. All right. Next, next, next. Oh, oh, okay. oh let's pull that out and Got see what we got. Jewelry in my fancy yeah, little hat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh wow, that's the best part. Now I'm joking. Yeah. <laughs> oh, let's go. Oh, wow. It's already paying off. Wow. Oh wow, that is a huge chain. That's, that's gotta be like a 25 inch chain. Yeah. Oh my goodness. That looks real. Does, does it, um, let me see here. Yep, Italy 925, guys. This is like a 20, probably four inch chain. Sheesh. That is huge. Let's check this one out here. Yep, Italy 925. This is also real. Wow. Two of them. Man. Dang. We got this big old. Oh, oh, that's that's huge. Cool. I don't even know what kind of rock that is, but that's beautiful. That's a, um, put a bunch of can, uh, I have no idea. Uh, quartz, I quartz. think. Quartz, yep. yeah. Maybe I do. <laughs> <laughs> Probably rose quartz, maybe. I don't know, let me know in the comments, guys. All right, what else, anything in here? Yep. Oh, something. Oh, Ooh. let's go. Wow. That looks real. I got a ring. It's nice. Yep, this is uh, this is nine two five guys. This is real. Beautiful ring there. And another one. Dang. They like their chains. Yep. 
They're balling, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's what the kids say nowadays. They're balling. That's pretty. Oh. Yep, that is old. Look at the clasp on this thing. Is that silver? Mm, I'm not sure what that is, but really cool. Well, that's not bad. Let's continue. Yeah. Well, let's continue, my guy. See what else is in here? Ah, a little painting. Yep. Gizmo. Okay. Oh. Oh, I could use some of those, actually. <laughs> Ash is like, screw the jewelry. <laughs> Let's see. And more, oh, the sleeves. Right oh, where's the Pokemon cards, guys? Where's the Pokemon cards? All right. Oh, oh, nice, son. Okay. oh son. It's not good. <laughs> <laughs> where's the Pokemon cards? Are those beats? Nope. There's a couple. Yeah. Let's be able to I have a Pokemon friend. Oh, right there. There. oh wow. Oh, let's go! Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's how we do it. Pull that bad boy out of here. Oh my gosh. Wow, guys. Look at that. Look at that. All Pokemon? That's All cool. Pokemon. Massive amount of Pokemon. And the sleeves. It's the biggest collection I've ever seen. Look at that. Let so me know in the comments Pokemon. if you guys collect Pokemon. Kay's likes them, but he doesn't quite understand collecting yet. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's a lot of Pokemon. Mm -hmm. It's nice how they sleep some of them. Oh yeah, and a bunch of duplicates. Oh, there's a lot of those shiny ones. Dang! The more shiny ones, whoa. I don't even want to pronounce that name. <laughs> <laughs> I would butcher uh, it. <laughs> Dialga. Dialga. Oh gosh. Dude, guys, look a at bunch. that. Let's go. Hopefully there's some, some collectible ones in oh, there. What do you got to be. Yeah. Especially with these little sleeves on them. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But, ooh, look at the shiny mm. one. <laughs> shiny. <laughs> Wiggle top. Wiggle top. Top. I don't even know how to say his name. Oh, wow. well, I'm not a Pokemon collector, but I know that's a pretty, pretty rare one right yeah. there. That's like the original Pokemon. Pikachu, <laughs> Pokemon, gotta catch them all. Nope. Oh, I got some like Yu-Gi-Oh in here too. Yeah. Wow. Some old Yu-Gi-Oh. Very cool. Guys, yeah, that 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 paid for a good portion of the unit oh, right there. Yeah. All right. Oh, we got one more box. Oh, one more. Oh, more sleeves and stuff. Okay, so, okay. Some envelopes, paper, office stuff. Just office stuff, yeah. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to give Ashley the camera. Okay. Oh, by the way, look at this. That's this cool. Grandma Ventures, we're going to put this on her site, but look at that. How thick that thing is. Hand blown. It's pretty cool. Okay. All right. What do you guys want to go through next? Jameson. They yeah. have a lot Jameson. of <laughs> All right, we'll use this table as a as an area to uh, unbox stuff here. Oh, look at that! Yeah, this box smells nice. I have a candle. Yep. I think it's just some good stuff in there. Oh, oh it's the lavender. Maybe I don't know. Box smell. There's not much in there, guys. Other than shells. Oh my gosh, there is, it is packed back there. Nope, fire mm -hmm. You never know when you might need one of those. Yeah, might need it in this unit. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Clothes. Oh man, okay, we don't go through clothes. By the way, by the way, this oh, is, I don't. I think they're gonna. Say I was gonna after say the fact. we're having the garage sale, but this is gonna be after the fact. 
So if you were there... Then... No, no, we can release this video before the... Nah, it'll be after the fact. Anyway, if you're at the garage sale, really nice seeing you. <laughs> we're filming this on a Sunday. The garage sale is going to be Saturday, but I don't know if I'll get this edited and, and sent out. So. We got a lot of work cut out for us. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's see what's in here. My man. Take yeah. a look at that. Oh, oh, paper. Some more, paper? more paper. paper. Okay. There you go. That one's a that's a tequila box. Oh yeah, living room. <laughs> oh, what happened to the knife? Uh, uh, he put it away for safety. Yeah. <laughs> probably, probably best. Oh, I Ooh, think it's glass. Stuff wait or something. a minute. All right, let's go through that. Oh yeah. Ooh, ooh, I like ooh, that. That's pretty. Ooh, that is pretty. That is nice. Wow. That is really pretty. Definitely something on the inside. Is it, is it jewelry? I'm also right-handed, by the way, so this whole <laughs> right-handed injury is not very helpful. Don't drop it. <laughs> Don't drop the deck. Oh, or no, that, a, that's actually a, what is a cap to a shower. Okay. Oh, yeah. There's a bunch of random stuff. <laughs> There's more. There is more. Oh, is there stuff inside? Is, it, is that metal up top or plastic? No, that's metal. Oh, you know what's inside? I think those little light things. Oh, you're make right. Make it light up. It's a twist top. I'm not gonna mess with it because I don't yeah. wanna break yeah. it. <laughs> this is kitchen bowls. You never know what kind of bowls, though. Hopefully not plastic. Well, I guess I could bust the knife out. Uh oh, there you go. we got the cutter. <laughs> it's like carving a turkey. At least you got your cast off. Yeah. yeah. When you go to the gym, do you just work one arm out? Well, I tell that to my doctor, but I don't actually do that. Uh, <laughs> I just, I push it too much, for sure. Ooh. Ooh. Shiny. See? Ooh, with some floral prints on them inside. Ooh, that's pretty. What's the brand on that? 22 karat gold. Ooh. Warranted. Wow. I don't know wow. how different brands. Oh. Is it the whole set? Ooh, Ooh that's pretty. Whoa. That's super pretty. Let's go. That's nice. It matches the, uh, the pigeon or the bird. <laughs> nice. That's nice, nice. Let me get another one in there. Ooh. Oh, wow. Let's go. Oh, man. Peacock. Oh, cool. Yeah, that is really cool. It's like Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> every day, every day. Up oh, for some just Gibson home. I don't know. Never some heard. random plate. Okay. Another peacock. Another peacock. No, that's ooh, that's um, ooh, that's corning ware. That's corning ware right there. Wow. Or fire king. Is it fire king? Oh yeah, fire king. Yep. Oh, wow. Old fire king. Ooh, that's nice. Nice little holiday plate. Look, look what we have for the. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's creepy. Oh, okay. Yeah. That is a little creepy. Oh, oh, there's another one. Matching set. Yeah. Maybe more. That's nice. Yep. That's nice. Set this down before I go. Yeah. Make this some room over here. Oh, wow. Ooh, got another one. Got another oh, a bunch more. of them. <laughs> yeah, this might be a little one. Probably don't have a dangerous set. This one, yeah. Oh, oh that's the last floor. one. Ooh, that is wow. pretty. That is pretty. I think this one's different, too. Oh, oh no. Same one. Same. This is far different. Wow, I'll show them that. That is pretty. Great 
graceful tea wear. Oh, those look graceful. All right, let me move this box. We'll do one more box real quick. See what this guy is. This is large base, very fragile. Very fragile, large base on here. Don't judge my knife cutting skills. I'm not left-handed. <laughs> the precision of this knife. Is... As long as the job gets done. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's why you brought them, folks. For yeah. <laughs> the entertainment. <There> <laughs> There's a couple things. Ooh, 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 that one. Jeez, it can't be very heavy though, because the box isn't so very heavy. Oh, oh yeah. it's a huge silver? Or platinum? Dang. <laughs> that's that, that's, that's a big cool. that's a big martini. Silver on the bottom. Yeah. yeah. Super cool. Cool. Is that the only one in there? No, there's another. Okay. Uh, something. Oh, maybe not. Yep, that's all it was. Okay. That fooled me. All right. We're going to take a quick commercial break, get the stuff in the truck. But when we get back, the jewelry chest, baby. Man, this is nice and it's all wrapped up. I want to see what's in these suckers. And so we'll go through some more boxes. Can finally see what's on the sides, too. So. We'll go through a lot of this stuff, guys. So hang tight. Don't go anywhere. All right. So we're pulling up all this furniture real quick. But uh, we want to at least show you guys if there's anything in here. Oh, there is, but not oh, much. Yeah. What is in here? Oh, this is an old record. Old record. Mm -hmm. What do we got over there? I don't know. E eagles. There's the eagles. Eagles. What else? Oh, What's gosh. the Dalmatian one? I don't know. Hmm. Is it something singles? We have the Eagles. Paradise. Hmm. Okay. Well, what else we got in here? Candles. Candles. It's in that box. Okay. Oh, okay. Nintendo. Let's go. Oh. oh. Looks like everything's here. Too. Dude, I used to have one of those when I was a kid. Oh, is there any games? Super, super, super Smash Bros. Oh, oh, it was Donkey Kong for me. Donkey Kong. Anybody play the Nintendo 64? Did you give it Nintendo 64? No, I had Nintendo Sega, but the 64 had a lot of silver games. Mm -hmm. No games, but two controllers. Dang, we'll probably find them. I don't even know how much these things go for nowadays. Everything. I think that's what it's. Been. Oh, yep. Pokemon. Okay. Oh, well, this is a nine. Oh, this is a lane. Yeah. I did not know that. So they, um, so there was actually some kids that got in trouble because they got in here and it locked on them. Uh, yeah. yeah. Lane actually went out of business. Uh, they don't make them anymore, but they're beautiful. Um, I didn't realize this was a lane. Kind of what threw me off was these kind of the front. It looked a little, but yeah, this is a beautiful lane. Wow. Oh, yep. Hmm. All right, well, Very nice. we're gonna go through some more stuff, so hang tight. <sighs> What's up, guys? Okay, everybody keeps asking me, Wade, where can I buy the stuff that you find in storage units? I'm putting it all the information right here for you. Um, yes, I find a lot of interesting stuff in storage units. So if you wanna purchase any of this stuff from me, directly from me, um, we're gonna be selling it on Whatnot, okay? Whatnot is an uh, auction platform that allows me to auction off everything that I find in storage units and it gets sent directly to you. It is amazing, it is super easy, and it is free. Also, uh, UK, Canada, you viewers can also buy from me now, not just the United States. So United States, UK, Canada, and a list of other countries can now buy stuff from me on my auctions live, uh, which is gonna be every Tuesday at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So in the next clip, I'll show you exactly how you can do that. Um, by the way, if you, the, all the links will be below to download whatnot. Make sure you use the link, 
because they actually give you 15 bucks free just for signing up that you can use towards one of your items that you purchased with me today. So everything will be on the next clip. Don't forget See guys, $15 completely free. If you're new to whatnot, they'll give you 15 bucks free on your first order. Uh, just click the link in the description of this video, or you can go to like the first comment. I'll pin it there. It'll take you right to the download page if you want to download their app on your phone, or if you want to go to the desktop, sign up. It takes two seconds and get ready for the auction because you'll need to be signed up before the auction, guys. If you already have whatnot downloaded, just go ahead and search Wade's Ventures in the search bar, and you're ready to rock. See you soon, guys. All right, so we did pull this out. <clears throat> um, I know this is in a lot of clips, guys, but we're trying to get a hole over here just so we can get back and get filming. A lot of furniture in this unit, and they don't have any carts. <laughs> no carts. This place has zero carts. So we had to haul all this stuff by hand. I have not done that in forever. I cannot remember a facility that did not have carts. Uh, anyway, so we're gonna open this up, guys. It's actually kind of nice. Um, couple, a little bit beat up. And we're gonna see what's in here. We got life jackets. Life jackets, the bigger blacker, blacker box. box. What is that? The, Cards Against oh, Humanity. Okay. I was gonna say well, what is that? Games. Everyone's it's favorite, a, everyone's a, favorite game, adult game. game. Yeah. It's like, well, how do scenario, I know about There's scenarios, you draw a handful of cards and you think, you pick which card you think okay. best represents that scenario. And it's a, an adult version, so you can kind of put one and two together there. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want him to explain it. That was pretty good. Is he, does anybody play that game? Put it in the comments. All right, we have life jackets. Life jackets. <laughs> I, I, I was wondering if it'd go any cards. further. <laughs> Seat backs. Uh-huh. Okay. Let's look. Okay. Oh, it's, yeah, it's missing the handle. I think we're gonna find a bunch of clothes in there. Yep. All clothes. What about that second drawer? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is it stuck? It's stuck. Okay. All right, hang tight, guys. We gotta get this thing. Oh, wait, did you get it? Okay. Oh wow. Okay. What's this? Oh, let's see what's in there. Oh, let's oh, this go. Is, gold. is this gold? You have you have a good eye for gold. Well, I mean you did make me go gold dredging yeah. <laughs> That is actual gold, guys. These are gold too. That is real gold nuggets. Nineteen forty two. You have a Zelda? <laughs> oh. <laughs> These are actual silver, yeah. These are all 1942, 1943s, right? Yep. This is, uh, I think it's what, 80% silver or 90% silver? Let us know in the comments, guys, but those are old silver. But this is actual gold. Wow. It's That's about cool. 80 bucks worth of gold. Maybe a little more. Okay, those are brand new, dude. Those are cool, I like them. A bunch of them, yeah. yeah. And they all have the tags with them and double wall those are actually really nice you know they're like 25 30 bucks i got a bunch of them brand new all the tags yeah. wonder where they got those things okay well this is actually not bad this, this i can't believe we found actual gold in here guys that is insane all right well we have our work cut out i've been uh I've been, uh, you know, kind of delaying this, but yeah. we we have a lot we have to do. <laughs> we'll get it. Yeah. All right. We'll be back in three hours after we get some of this to the truck. Don't go anywhere. All right. We're back. Let's start with this box right here. A um, little progress report here. We're making our way through the unit, guys. There's a lot of furniture in here, folks. Still got to figure out what's in here. A lot of furniture. A lot of furniture. Okay, what do we got over here? Oh wow. Ooh, let's go. That's a hunting knife. That's don't, cool. Don't cut yourself. Don't cut yourself. <laughs> Let me see. I'm a professional. They want to see it up close. Do they? Wow. Here, it's pretty over here. Very pretty. Okay. <laughs> this is a probably a nine inch blade. Original Bowie knife. Original Bowie knife. What is that? I mean, 
Made in Germany. Made in Germany. Oh, wow. At least that's what this says. Where does it say? This yeah. is Germany, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Original Bowie knife made in Germany. This could be something here, guys. It's a big boy. I mean, I've heard of Bowie knives, but... Hmm. Isn't this a style of hunting knife? Yeah. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> and you see him walking, like, further away as I... <laughs> Okay. All right. Well, what else we got in there? Oh. Whoa! Let's go. That's super pretty. That is really pretty. Do you put flowers in there? Yeah. This is definitely hand blown. Mother's Day is coming up too. Yep. Oh. Oh. Shout you know, out to all you mothers. Get something for your mother. I will. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't yet, but I will. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. See, we even got some AC units over here, guys. You can see right there some bigger, bulky stuff. I try to get out of the unit. We're gonna have like five AC units at the garage sale. It's gonna be crazy. Aren't two of them new in the thing? Uh, I don't know if they're new necessarily, but. <laughs> well, there's ghosts inside. Yeah, something fell. Oh, there's a wing. Oh, a little egg. Probably titanium or uh, nope, never mind. China ring. Is that a ring or is that just supposed to sit for the eggs? Mm -hmm. a ring. Oh, okay. Oh, is it broken? Mm -hmm. oh. Oh. After the, that mattress unit, he's very cautious. There's change in here, but there's some miscellaneous items. <laughs> like? Uh, are, are they adultish? Oh, wood finish. Okay, there okay. we go. We're good <laughs> to go. We're safe. A couple markers. A lighter. Okay. And then... Uh, generic little cut. Yep. Okay, so anything else in the thing? Yep. Oh, yeah. Anything good? Oh, here's another one of those candle things. Okay. You got two of those. This is... And that's it. Man, this Bowie knife is worth it, baby. Beautiful. Okay. You want to take a couple more of those boxes over there? What's in that? That Yeah. This one? We'll take that. And the singer. Oh, oh wow. They're in there. Let's go. Wow. What are they? What, are what, nice. what brand are they? Um, I don't know. Shun. Shun? S H U N. Let me see what that says. Okay, Shun. They look fancy. Mm -hmm. DM 0706, made in Japan. Carbon steel. Carbon steel made in Japan. Chef's knives. Man, I bet they're sharp too. Oh, yeah, they feel sharp. Man. That's two back-to-back -back cool sets, huh? That's nice, huh? We ran to go see if there was a cart. We oh. hear cart noises, and then we have to, like, run and see. Because <laughs> there's, <laughs> there's, there's no carts in this place, and we had to do every box by hand. It's been a long day. Yeah, yeah it's been a very long day. I had an auction earlier today for three hours, so... Sorry if I don't seem energetic. Just... And we're up against the clock because we only have four days to get five units cleaned out, 16 truckloads to the house for the rod cell. So, all right, let's try. Let's 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 take out that singer box. Yeah. See if there's anything in there. Oh, it's heavy. Ooh, it's heavy. Mm hmm Ooh, that's an old singer. Oh, let's not show that. It's an old singer. You don't want to show the singer? Mm, I don't want to show this. Uh, oh. Yeah, we don't want to see that. Nope, that's an adult. That's an adult item. It looks cool, but yeah. Okay. How nice of you. Yeah. See, guys, he's getting the hang of it. He's getting the hang of it. Oh. I mean, that's a nice looking singer. What else is in here? Clear your feet. Clear your feet. Yeah. And then this is the oh. singer thing. Original singer box. Mm -hmm. Dang. Oh. <laughs> oh, I did not break that. Hmm. Oh yeah, hmm. not bad. Anybody make their own clothes around here? 
No, I make blankets. <laughs> I made a pillow once. What about oh you? My gosh, that's I have never touched one of these <laughs> until this exact moment. Uh, <laughs> yeah, don't expect him to make any of your clothes, guys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. This is the Touch Tonic 2010. All right. Let me uh, let me go ahead and put this stuff away. We'll be right back, and we'll do everything by hand because I have every single box we have to haul downstairs by hand. You can see I'm sweaty. We'll be right back. Uh, give us credit. I think. <laughs> I think we did most of the lift. What? Are you kidding me? You just shoved it over the elf. Oh! The dragon. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. We'll be right back. All right. Yeah. Before we start and open this thing up. It's pretty. Pretty. Really cool. It's exciting. Um, I carried everything down there oh and, and loaded it up in the truck so you can see by hand. All by himself. That's why we're, I have my I'm not sweating. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Ready? Let's do it. Let's show what's in the box. That's a beautiful box. Uh, check up there, maybe. Yeah, see if we can use them. It's, it's kind of entertaining to see him do it with just one hand. One hand, but. <laughs> okay. Is it open? Oh, okay. <gasps> oh, wow. oh. Lord. My goodness. Oh. oh. OMG, baby. OMG. Oh Let's go. I was, for some reason, I wasn't like thinking that it would actually be. You know what? I wouldn't be shocked if we find some gold in here. Oh my gosh. Bunch of gold rings. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my gosh. Wow. <gasps> that was oh real. my real? gosh. It is. Italy. I see Italy. Is it 14K? Those are two different ones, I think. 10 karat gold, baby. Woo. Put this, that. this now adds to the collection of the retirement from <laughs> Yes. Earlier. This is 925. 925? So that is dirty. still beautiful. He's trying it on. So cute. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Wow. That this is, is silver. Oh, my Lord. You can't make this stuff up, folks. Oh, wow. Look at this. 10 karat gold. 10K gold. You guys see that? Oh, my. Oh, man. That was a pretty blue one. Uh -huh. You cannot make this up. What is this all big old sucker here? If, if a couple of those things are silver, man. We got, we're hitting on some. Is this one of those burst stones things? Is that what that is? Mm-hmm. See, I machine. know a thing or two. Let's see on the chains. Good luck. <laughs> Do we need magnifying this? We need uh, an expert in Wade's Ventures. Okay, well, expert, and uh, yeah, there's oh. an expert here. That's pretty. No. Oh, oh my cool. goodness. What is it? Man, that looks. I'm not an expert in watches, just so you know. <laughs> I'm, I'm not either. Thing is pretty though. What the heck is this? This could be gold plated. Here, what's the sound on the back? I don't see any markings or I can't tell. You know what that could be? Bolva? B U L O V A? Bolivia? Bolivia? Or Bolva? Bolivia? Bolivia? I don't know. I'm not a watch guy. <gasps> Bring it over here. This looks exactly like my great grandmother's ring. Almost. Mm. Oh my gosh. This is white gold. I guarantee it. 14 karat, yep. This is white gold. Those are real diamonds. Yeah. Wow. That's, that's why. That's why we do this, right? That's why we do this. Oh, I was gonna see what channel you did. Oh. <laughs> so the, oh my God. Yeah, that's real. Those are real diamonds right there, folks. Uh oh. Coins. Don't lose it. There you go. Mm -hmm, coins. Oh my gosh. I bet you these are coins. That does kind of Oh yeah, these are big boys. These are World War II medals. These are some big boys. Mmm. Yep. Those are some. Ooh. Oh, wow. World War II. World War II. These are old. What do we got there? It's a one dollar. A bunch of one dollars. There's this really cool old one over here, too. Yep, these are silver. Silver dollars. Yep. These are 
put these over here. Let's see. Mm -hmm. There you go. Well, let's just, let's continue here. Oh my gosh. Wouldn't that be sick if this is gold? We found a couple of these similar ones like this. We're gonna have to get these things, some of these oh, checked cool. out. There we go. Mm hmm. That's silver. Um, okay, what's in there? Here's the chest inside the chest. <laughs> the chest inside the chest. Cool it's always a good time. Oh, oh wow. Oh my goodness. Wow. Beautiful pocket watches. Mm -hmm. They open. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. So much gold. It's shiny. Mm -hmm. I think this looks real right here. You know, I bet it is. These people don't have fake. Uh... This... Yep, this is real. What does that say on the class? Oh penny? my goodness. Ooh. Two dollar <laughs> note. Yep. It's like gold plated or yep. something. Hmm. Think this is real? You know what? You know what? I don't know. These pocket watches are cool. This is real. Uh, read the, the clasp on that. I think it's 10 carat, right? <laughs> Sometimes it'll say on the inside. Let's get that checked out. I think you're right. Yeah, I, I saw a 10 carat. I was just. Mm, you have some good eyes. Making her work for it. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to barbecue tonight! <laughs> yeah. I, don't, I don't think they take. Huh? Some, no, 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 no. They, no, actually, they, they should nowadays, you'd think, you know? By the way, that's not a real gun, that's a BB gun. Um, okay. So give us one second, guys. I'm going to go through this real quick, find all the gold, and we'll be right back to show you. Don't go anywhere. I was not expecting this for you guys. Uh -huh. Insane. All right, do the money sign. Yes, 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 <laughs> do the money sign again. Yeah. Okay, let's go guys. So we did separate stuff. Now, I will be uh, bringing this stuff to the pawn shop so they can do some acid testing for me. But to my knowledge, and by the way, did you see how beautiful this stone is? It's gorgeous. I mean, look at that stone, folks. Um, so all these are stamped 10 and 14 karat gold, folks. Um, so bring those pretty little fingers over here. Let's put some yeah. on your fingers. Just give them a little. There you go. There's that. Okay. Oh, that. Stuff sure. Now all, all of these are, <laughs> all of these are, <laughs> uh oh, wait, hold on. Let me put this over here. <laughs> all of these that I'm putting on his fingers now are gold. Okay. Oh, we may need to put that one there. Oh, oh that didn't work right there okay this is gold as well put it right there and this is gold man that's pretty look at that i don't even know what stone that is that's gold and this is gold we'll put that over there oh yeah and nice little manicured fingers <laughs> um okay these are actually gold as well but we're okay let's show them the rings first these are all gold guys here bring it over here bring it over here against the white mm-hmm mm-hmm <laughs> <laughs> Pretty, <laughs> pretty. Okay. Um, this is 14 karat gold. This is actually 14 karat gold as well. You can see Italy. Oh, sorry, 10 karat gold. This is 10 karat gold, 14 karat gold. Oh, these are also gold as well. It's pretty, all the silver. I still want to go through all these. Not entirely sure if there's more gold in there or not. I don't know anything about these watches. So we're gonna have to get these checked out. There's two of them. Pretty cool. I do need to get these checked out there. So they have a Maker's Mark stamp on them. Probably not real gold, but I'll keep you updated on these. Because um, they're real gold. We're retiring! Yeah. You won't see any more Wage Ventures videos. <laughs> I'm joking. You probably will. Um, anyway, and then we've got some more over here and some more over here we got to check out. But all these are gold. And then, of course, we've got the silver coins. Um, I do need to check a couple of these pen these these out because they're stamped 10 karat. There's a couple here that are stamped 10 karat gold. So I'm not entirely sure. Those may be not real, but we'll get everything checked out. And this here could be 
something, folks. I don't know. This is really old stuff here. Look at this. Is this isn't a Hamilton watch. Very old Hamilton watch. So anybody knows about watches, let me know. Also, if you know anything about this watch, let me know. She is old. Let's bring it over here. I don't know anything about watches, and I know some watches could be gold. The thing that makes me think that this could be gold, and um, Holden brought it up, was the fact that one of the rings, this one right here, matches it a little bit. See? So I'm wondering if it was if it, if that's real gold or not. But anyway, and and then not to mention, look at that box, guys. This thing is old, beautiful box. This thing is gorgeous. The eye of gold. <laughs> oh, and then we did get this stuff. What is this stuff over here? Metals. Oh yeah, metals. You want to open this up real quick? All the metals, so we can show them. These are World War II American campaign. Not all of it. I think most of them are. Yeah. See, it says World War II. World War II. Really cool pieces of history. So we got those. <laughs> all right. Let me put my gold away, folks. And we shall be right back, okay? And don't worry, you. that won't be the last time you see those pretty fingers. We'll be right back, guys. <laughs> All right. Bonus time. We didn't show these. I've never seen these before, but these are actual gold nuggets. Um, these are small little gold nuggets. You can definitely tell that is real gold. That's a real gold nugget right there. And then this one as well. So I don't know why they had these or what they had on, but those are actual real gold nuggets. Also... My man over here found this. Look at that. 1921. Goes on your wrist, guys. Really cool. So we found we found man. They're good. I did not really expect good. this out of this box. No. You know, I was expecting something different, like Pokemon cards. You well, know, like, I was expecting like personal. I wasn't expecting to find like fifteen hundred to two thousand dollars worth of gold. You know what I mean? Ching. All right. All right, guys, it's getting late. I've got to finish this video, so we're going to quickly go through the unit, find anything else possibly that we can put on here. Sorry we're cutting this short. I'm literally doing this on a Sunday. Um, I have a garage sale in like three to four days. I had to prepare for 16 truckloads, so we're trying to do a quick, kind of quick video. But we'll be right back. Don't go anywhere, and hopefully he can help because this man over here, needs, well, he's like half a man right now, but we'll see. All right, guys, we'll grab. All right, we're done for the day. Ah, it's, it's late. I'm so exhausted. Uh, my feet hurt. So, what I'm gonna do, basically, guys, is uh, I'm gonna take you along to the pawn shop. Hopefully tomorrow. So I'll take you live at the pawn shop while they go through all the gold and silver and see which was real, which is fake, or which is not, which is. So you guys can see all this cool stuff that we found. So stay tuned. That's the next clip. Don't go anywhere. All right, this is the next day. We're at Cut Above Pond, guys. They're in Beaverton. This is their new, their new uh, location here. So you guys should stop by. I'll put the, I'll put them up on the screen. So you guys, oh, there's Ashley. <laughs> I forgot you. She's not pretty today, guys. Um, all right, so we're at Pud, Cut, Cut Above Pond. We're gonna take a look at all this jewelry that we found yesterday. Hopefully, we find some gold. I'm thinking we did. And uh, yeah, let's. And, and also the old piece that is not marked, but I believe it's gold as well. But we'll see, because last time I was wrong, and I I lost like 30000 yesterday because it was fake. <laughs> All right. And th by the way, this is the beautiful chest that you guys saw, so it shows up better in this lit room here. All right, my man, let's get into it. So we found a lot. We'll start with this one right here, actually. Um, oh, let me see. We'll start with this. Yeah, this one right here. There's a ton in here, guys. So we'll start with the big rings first, see if we found any any gold in there now it is a lot of it's marked um so this is the piece that i believe is i think it's gold but um and i did test the diamond the diamond did test real yeah wait um, feels good and um i all this other stuff is marked as well there's actually gold nuggets in here i don't know what they did there but i'm um, also got another piece here that i believe is where that other piece goes like a 
Oh crap, where did it go? Hopefully we didn't put it in a different area. Oh no. I want to find it. Maybe it's in a different one. Oh, right here. Oh, snuck in there. I think that looks real as well. Um, yeah. I, now, I did find information on here. This was from 1960s. So this is probably the grandma, grand, or sorry, excuse me, grandfather's. Yep. Um, do you want to give a shout out to mom? She, maybe she's watching this video. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, Miss Jenkins. <laughs> all right. Uh, so so the, all this stuff we want to see if it's real. And then we got a ton more in here. Yeah. I'm going to go we'll, grab my test Okay, equipment. cool, cool. All right, guys. We'll be right back. We're going to test this stuff out and let you know how much we found. All right, guys. We're ready. We got some good news, I think, right? Oh, yeah. Um, so first off the bat, this stuff is costume. Um, so we're going to go ahead and shut this just to save time. It's not gold or silver, or it could be silver plated. Now this, we're not selling it because it's illegal, but it is real. Uh, what is it again? It's um, uh, Tusk. Tusk. This is actual Tusk, guys, that we found. Probably walrus, yeah. but without us knowing anything yeah. or having documentation, it's not for sale. Uh, yep, we can't sell this. It's, that's illegal. Um, all right, so and then over here, this is the uh, normally I'd be excited about getting silver guys But with all this gold over here, it's hard to get excited over here But this is actually really pretty and I think this is a women's right? Yes, okay, and these stones did test real for me, but um, we'll, we'll test them again This is actually mark silver a lot of times the stones aren't real with silver So we'll test those again, but this is all silver folks all marks 925 Italy and then we also have some silver stuff too. And this right here, I didn't know, is a Chinese ball. Yes. <laughs> Called a dong. Uh, Benoit. Oh, Benoit, sorry. Um, all right, so we have all those. Now we're getting to the good stuff, guys. So we'll start here. Freedom. I don't know a lot about watches, but apparently this is actually real gold on this one. Yes, so uh, Bulva Accutron, made in the 50s. Um, the case is not and the band is not, but however, someone did custom make the gold inlay right here with the uh the jade stones that's really cool yeah the yeah. really cool movement if you put the battery in it it's a nice watch to have it's a beautiful watch and then we got the nuggets we're gonna put those in a jar uh, along with the actual gold that we found uh and then we found this this is 18 karat gold right here what kind of stone is that uh, citrine citrine and it's got a real diamond on there by the way guys the little diamond up top this 18 karat this i was questioning but it looks like it's real gold like a custom thing right yes uh solid gold uh border on a real coin silver uh, coin that, that is really really cool um okay so we got these out of the way these we're going to test live with you guys so you can see the acid test and process and then we have some information on this these beauties here yep so the larger men's ring um 1950s it is sterling so not much gold or excuse me uh metal value but it's still historically valuable and the other is actually a very small engagement ring from the 40s or 50s uh mine cut diamond um i believe it to be 14 karat but back in the day could be 18 could be platinum and look how small the fingers are yeah oh my gosh dude. wow um all right so we got those out of the way and then we have a cool watch over here and by the way, this is our watch expert. So if you guys have watches, bring it into uh, bring it into the pawn shop here, and he'll tell you all about it. I don't know much about this one, but it is gold plated. This one, right? Yes, gold. Okay, filled. this one's gold filled. All right. Now, let's get to the good stuff. Let's talk about these two things here. This is a hit right here, boys and girls. So, Waltham pocket watch. And if we crack open the back twice. Wow. Oh, could I borrow your ID for a moment? Solid 14 karat. Wow. So the movement, 15 joule. Waltham, probably 20s-ish. I could be wrong on that. Um, but the case alone, if you just wanted to melt just for the case, solid heavy. Solid 14. Uh, same thing on this guy. Okay. How old do you think this one is? I don't know, but I could find out in a few okay. minutes of research. <laughs> So, older Elgin, this one's a little small for a pocket watch. However, this one as well. Solid gold. Solid, guys. I tried to open it, so he's much better yep. at this than I am. 14 karat on that one as well. Wow, that is insane. Uh, this one is running, so it does increase the value. This one might need a service, not running. 
probably just worth it for the gold. This one being running, worth it for the watch. Nice. Okay, and we're gonna test these. We'll leave these to last to show you the tester here. And we're, we, I'm, he's pretty certain that this is all gold as well, you know. Just it, a lump of yeah. 10 karat and 14 karat, nothing on the magnet, yeah. all the colors and weights look great. Yep, and by the way, this is the magnet here, folks. So, all right, so this is all gold. Man, gold, 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 baby, okay. Now let's talk about this. Oh wait, yeah, let's talk about this right here. All right, so charm bracelet. The bracelet alone is just plated, it's marked plated. However, each individual charm, I was able to find a 10 karat mark on. And there's 26 charms, guys. So there's 26 10 karat gold charms on here. Pretty insane. So it's... It's heavy. It's heavy. So right, yeah. That, uh, 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 if you guys remember that one when we took it back to Cut Above Ponds, oh, and I no, thought I was like worth thirty thousand dollars, I was like, I'm buying me a new BMW. Yeah, yeah, that was not real, but these are all real. <laughs> yep. This is all ten karat gold, guys. Let's go. All right. Now we're gonna do this one last because okay. people want to know about that. Oh, let's do about this one right here, actually. Oh, so this one. This is also another 40s, 50s era um, engagement ring. This one is platinum with diamonds. Um, roughly two thirds carat each, so carat and a half probably total weight, but it is platinum. Um, they don't really use platinum much anymore, but in the 50s, very common on engagement rings. You know, you know the cool thing about this is it has a little note in here. And I, I <laughs> pretty cool, huh? Given in 1934 and passed in 1964. Yep. A lot of this is old, guys. Really, really cool stuff. I'm curious to see if that's gold. We'll check that in a second. All right. We'll talk about... We'll, we won't spend too much time here because I don't want to take too much time but uh, of, of these guys. But let's go through some of these rings because they are dying to see if they're real. Yep. So everything in this box, gold. Um, Look at how beautiful that got is. Got a nice... This one's handmade. No maker's marks. Uh, that is an opal. We uh, a duplet opal, I believe, mm -hmm. which is where it's a slice of opal, and then they put a slice of quartz on top, so it gives it the clear dome. Wow! And gives it the depth. That's something you probably don't want to melt down. That's a no. beautiful ring. This guy, another solid gold center stones, about a carat and a half. Wow! All the smaller stones. This guy got a, about a one carat in the middle. This guy, two half carat diamonds. And then the custom gold with the jade. And that goes with the watch, guys. Um, so I, I was telling him before, like, I can see this guy playing poker with all these uh, big old rings on. All right, so all these are gold. And, and you got pearls over here. What, what do you think that is right there? Is that a topaz? I think that is a blue topaz. Yeah. It's got two, two diamonds on there as well. I found that this one was really beautiful, too. It's got two diamonds in the middle, guys. All right, all gold, baby? No. Let's go to this over here. Right. So, nuggets. <laughs> we got nuggets over here. Nuggets. So let's just get a good rub. Okay. Now we got to find out what... Now, before you put the acid on there, what are you thinking? 10K, 14K? Nuggets are hard. What, what's your guess? Nuggets, I'm going to go... I'm going to go 10K. Op optimistically, I'm going to go 18. Ooh, okay. Let's go. So, let's I'm going to start with... Remember, it is Texas, so everything's bigger in Texas. <laughs> Anybody in Texas around here? 10. Oh, it's definitely not 10. Holds on 10. Yep, see. And just to, can you explain to him like what happens if it... Yeah, so I basically, I take a rubbing, not a scratch, but just a rubbing of the metal, puts a little bit on there, and as the acids go up, they eat more of the gold or other impurities away. So as I go up, it gets stronger acid. And he's got two other ones over there. Drop a 14. Oh. I think we have 18, don't we? Yep. And that's holding at 14. Wow, this guy spent a lot of money. Well, he was from the 60s, so maybe not as much as today. And this is 18. Oh, went right away on the yep. 18. So it's 18? Yep. Actually, right away on 18 and then holding at 18, actually. Yep, so yep. one is 18 and one is 14. Wow. Which one's the 18? Um, I don't recall which one I did first. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> uh, you did that one first. Yep. Yeah. So Texas is 14. Nugget is 18. Oh my gosh, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Well, let's do two of these real quick. Yeah, me, this one I was unsure about. Yeah, let's Looks do that to one. be gold, but no stamps. Okay. 
Okay. So fold it ten. I did test the diamonds on there, guys. The diamonds did test real. Those are real diamonds on there. Hold the fourteen. Wow. So that is a fourteen carat. Dang, let's go. And let's go with this. Let's try I was that a little out. unsure about that one. I, I was unsure of it too because it's because one of the things were broke off, but. Oh, that could be 14. Holds a 10. Yeah. What happens if you get this acid on your hands? Uh, it'll turn it yellow for about two weeks and then your skin falls off. <laughs> Leave it up to the professionals, folks. That's why we go to the pawn shop. Yeah, here. immediately yeah. wash your hands if you touch this yeah, stuff. Okay. Uh, this one holds a 14 as well. Oh, wow. So I believe that to be real. Okay, let's try one more here. Let's, I was let's really go. curious about these based on the toning. Right. Um, it was a little darker. I think it's gold, but we'll see. Yeah. Holds it. Ten. Man, there was a special lady with this guy. He really did take care of his. Oh. Goes away at 14, so these are 10, 10 karat gold. <gasps> Look at this. Oh, my lordy lord, guys. Well, remember, cut above ponds. We're in Beaverton, uh, right off Highway 8. These guys are amazing. Been going here for darn near two years now, man. Yeah. Two or three years now. So. Uh, if you guys have any like questions or you want to sell them some stuff or you want to buy some stuff, they've got a beautiful showroom here. I love the new location a lot better. The uh, old location was great, but this one here is a really nice layout. And they also have some really cool guitars, guys. So come in here. See my man. All of, the, all of them are great, though. And I really appreciate it, guys. We hit the jackpot. Did we hit the jackpot? Oh, yeah. And we paid a thousand bucks for the unit. Did we make money? Uh, easily. Did we make money on the unit? A thousand bucks. So pretty insane. Not the greatest unit, but that goes to show. It just takes a couple items to turn things around. Anyway, what do you think, honey? Are we making diamond earrings? She wants to take some of those stones and make diamond earrings. We'll see, though. Let me know, guys, in the comments. Should we make diamond earrings for Ashley? We'll see. All right, guys. See you until next time. Much love. Appreciate it.